empty. Where'd he go? Hm. Ich Kühlschrank durchgesucht, das wird über nächstes Clown. Ha. Huh. Tragbarer Kochen, Kocher, Schaufeln, scheint alles, was man so gerauchen könnte. Die Tür ist oh. offen. So ist er wohl rausgekommen. Wie denn sonst? Oh. Da. Wer hängt denn da im Zaun? This gap. Alter, das ist riesengroß, da passt jeder durch. Oh, wobei, so groß ist doch nicht. Be able to get here too. Huh? It's a watch. Did the kid drop it? To my dear son Matthew. Matthew. Halt Armbanduhr. Ashley, what are you doing out here? Tommy, just trying to get through the hole in the fence. Wait, no way. What? Did you break into the storage room? What? Okay, hang on. Just tell me how you got in there. I, I. The door was locked. I shouldn't admit to opening the door myself. It was, um, open when I got here. Ashley, seriously. It was. Honest. We didn't get the charcoal delivery, so I came to pick it up. I was waiting for you when I heard a sound from the back. I went inside and saw the back door open. Someone's been eating the inventory. Was it you? Excuse you. I'm no thief. Then who was it? Probably the boy who escaped through that fence. What boy? Where is he? He ran off. Sure he did. Do you have any proof? Äh, es war natürlich klar, als er der Depp. Ich war das nicht. Hm. Ach ja, dann beweis mir, dass du es nicht warst. Schau mal, was ist das? Fußspuren, die sind nicht von meinen Schuhen. Und ein paar Pfotenabdrücke. Was ist denn passieren? Naja, das allein beweist nicht deine Unschuld. Tommy! Sieh dir das mal an. Uhr und weiter? Die hat der Junge verloren. Soll ich wissen, ob es nicht deine ist? Ja, jetzt komm schon. Ich weiß überhaupt nichts. Soll ich ihn jetzt beweisen? Darn it. Kann man sich die Mühe aus und das Dörfleisch ebenso. Hängt sie durcheinander? Was ist das eigentlich für die Kiste? Was war denn für Gäste? So ein Matthew eingraviert. Hm? Äh, 
Äh. Was soll ich jetzt auspacken? Schon gesehen? Was ist das? Hat da mit Wasser drin, der Hund hat rausgetrunken. Hm. Ich da hingestellt, das ist ein Loch im Dach. What? Ernsthaft? Lügner, da ist kein Loch. Hm. Hm? Das ist eigentlich, soll mich mal umschauen. Oh. Rausgehen, aber komm nicht auf die Idee wegzulaufen. Ach Gott, ich darf da raus? Hm. Ich brauche ihn, Tommy zu überzeugen. Ah. Das könnte ein Beweis sein, aber wie kann ich das Tommy zeigen? Ich durch ein weiteres Foto überzeugen. Ah, anstatt dass ich hier den blöden Kameraknopf drücke, Alter, mach ich es wieder so. Um. Vor davon, ich muss es mir nur zeigen. Kann ich es ihm zeigen? So nicht. Man muss ich von denen ein Bild machen? Guck mal. Hm? Beweis? Oh, ich hätte bloß mit ihm reden sollen. There. Ein Junge und einen Hund draußen gefunden. Die hat der Junge zurückgelassen. Hm. Wirklich? Hä? Ja, und jetzt? Vielleicht eine weitere Sache, um Tommy zu überzeugen. Hm. Ist das Loch im Zaun geflohen? Vielleicht ist das Loch im Zaun Beweis genug. Alright. Kann Tommy nichts sagen. Ich hoffe, die sind genug. Das ist, wenn ich gewusst hätte. Detektiv Ashley ist unterwegs. Deswegen mag ich auch so Spiele wie Aft, äh, hey. Master Detective Ar Archives Raincoat und so. Noch eins? Hm? There. Ja, es ist so ein großes Loch, da ist der Junge durchgeklettert. Ich yeah. das Loch schon mal gesehen, But... aber. Dass da jemand durchgestiegen ist. Uh. Das ganze Beweise gezeigt, du glaubst mir immer noch Got nicht. It. Schon gut, schon gut, das reicht. Ich schätze, es war jemand anders da. So you finally believe I'm innocent in all this? Yeah, okay. I should have listened to you. 
<sighs> I'm glad you get it. How do you think the kid got in? The door was definitely locked. Can I just get that charcoal? My dad sent me for it. Oh yeah, I totally forgot. Called it. <laughs> I can take it over. Everyone's waiting. That'd be great. Thanks. I'll grab it. Go ahead and wait by the counter. Ja, und welchem Jungen geht's? Scheiß drauf. Is that everything? Yep. As ordered. One bag of charcoal. Need any help? I've got it. I'll let you get back to work. Break time's over, I guess. I know it'll be hard, but really try. Hey now. <laughs> get mine. Later, Tommy. Alter, wie schwer ist das? Ashley, wait up. Yeah? I really should be the one to drop it off. Let me grab it. I also want to apologize to Dr. Robbins for the trouble. Sure. Thanks. I'll carry it. Let's go. Okay. Ja, auf jeden Fall ist die Laune schon besser bei ihr. Achso, der ist direkt hinter mir. Ich hab bloß nicht mehr gehört. Ob man jetzt mehr selber erforschen dann auch muss, weil das ein größeres Gebiet ist. Weil es fehlt mir immer ein bisschen bei solchen Spielen, dass du vielleicht ein bisschen was selber machen musst. Dad, I got the charcoal. Wo ist er jetzt schon wieder? Where is he? Ashley, right? I'm Ian Tyler, a colleague of Dr. Robbins. Ian Tyler. He asked me to give you a message. He had to go deal with an emergency oh. in the JC Valley. I offered to go instead, since you're here and all, but he said it had to be him. Seriously? I have to say, Dr. Robbins is very dedicated. He was so focused on preparing for this trip, he skipped breakfast. And now he'll miss lunch because he's run off to fix some new problem. I've never met anyone so willing to drop everything and rush off to the lab. Dedication aside, who could walk away from a feast like this? He must be perpetually hungry. Hi, Ashley. I'm Gina Barnes. Gina Barnes. Dr. Robin said you're welcome to his chair. So let's have a good time. Okay. I'll leave the charcoal here. Thanks. Tommy, over here. Yo. It's those girls. So, about the band contest. Contest? We still haven't found the music player. Seriously? What are we gonna do? We'll re-record it. Change it up with a new song, maybe? That'll never work. That was our best performance by far. Well, we can't just throw away our chance. Ugh. So those two are in Tommy's band. No, the kleine Drecksjunge hat bestimmt den... ...die Sachen. Your food is ready, Sophia. Oh, I'm all right. I already ate. I'll take it, Director. Ian, 
Grab the salt. So was ist halt richtig arschig, Alter. If I knew it would be like this, I would have gone to band practice instead. Oh shit, where is this shit? Mr. Kinderentführer or what? Hello. You must be Ashley. Uh huh. Pleasure to meet you. My name is Ryan Gray. I work with Dr. Robbins. Do you have time to chat? Uh. This guy... Have I... met him somewhere before? So wird irgendwie so böse wie der Augen. Man soll ja Leute nach sowas nicht beurteilen, aber in Spielen ist das meistens dann halt schon ein Indikator. Alles klar, der hat Dreck am Stecken. Oder versucht's jedenfalls. Kapitel 2, Matthew. Ja, findet man raus, wo er ist, können wir ihn verprügeln. Wo ist der Schlagstock? Haben wir einen Elektroschocker? Wie benutzt man Waterboarding? <lacht> Entschuldigung, nix gegen Folter. Äh, umgekehrt, Folter ist nicht gut. Nix gegen Folter, Alter. My name is Ryan Gray. I work with Dr. Robbins. Ja, wie eine gesprungene Scheibe, das hast du schon mal erzählt. Die graue Farbe halt dann auch. Ryan Gray. Do you have time to chat? Nice to meet you. Have I seen this guy before? I swear I've met him somewhere. It must be my imagination. Do you truly doubt your memories? Huh? What? I know what was going through your mind just now. I feel like I've met him before, but it's just my imagination. Isn't that right? How could you know that? I'm a behavioral psychologist, you see. Plus, your facial expressions are quite easy to read. Are you saying that I have a bad poker face? <laughs> You're the same as ever. Always up front with your emotions. Wait, so you do know me? What's your guess? I was here with my mom 13 years ago. So maybe I saw you then. Nice deduction. Myelination in our hippocampus is a slow process, said to only finish when we're around four years old. Myelinisierung? That's why most people can't remember their early years. Ach so. Also ist dein Gehirn noch nicht so ausgebildet, dass es sich Erinnerung bilden kann. Okay. But as soon as I got here, I remembered. Mom and I... You remembered something from all those years ago? Yeah. I'm not even sure I'd heard of Lake Juliet before, but once I was here and saw the place, I remembered the scenery and being here with Mom. But if you ask me if I was sure those memories were real, I wouldn't be able to say yes. As I said, it's tough to recall events from that early in life. Yet, sometimes, an event can bring them to the surface. Some call these sudden memories flashbacks. They often occur after psychological trauma. Do you remember ever having such an experience? Yeah, I do. My mom died on the night of my third birthday. That was 13 years ago. Ah, yes, that's right. Sayoko Robbins, she was only 28 years old. You know what happened to my mom? 
Of course. As a memory researcher myself, the sudden death of Sayoko Robbins was an unforgettable tragedy. To meet her daughter after all these years is truly remarkable. You and I have a lot in common. Speaking with you like this brings back memories of Sayoko. Particularly your eyes. It's like your mother is looking out at me. She was a genius. She began her research at just 16 years old. Thus? That was around the time when I first met her. She was a scientist by the time she was my age? That's incredible. Your mother was an outstanding scientist. Immer diese Japaner. <laughs> Oder Chinesen. I could Asiat. never forget her. 16 Jahre. Is it really true that my mom was doing scientific research at 16? Yes, it is. <laughs> wie sich das anhört? Weißt du, da siehst du, da gibt's so Serien wie die, die diese Ami-Serien der Miles Sweet 16 mit irgendwelchen verwöhnten Gören, Alter, die wohl ihren 16. Geburtstag feiern mit 10.000 und 100.000 von Euro, was dafür ausgegeben werden. Und die hörst halt von jemandem, nicht mal klar, Fiktion und so, aber der halt mit 16 schon eine Wissenschaftlerin war. Oder halt in die Richtung forscht oder irgend so ein Scheiß. Wer hat wohl die bessere Zukunft? Okay, sie ist mit 88 erschossen worden, aber normalerweise. Ugh. What's the matter? I'm just so average compared to her. Are you interested in the sciences as well? No, not really. I don't want to be like my dad. I see. Well then, what do you want to be? I play guitar in a band. We're gonna be huge. A band. Interesting. Yeah. I wanna be on stage. I wanna move people with my music. I wanna make them feel something. I think everyone has a grand design like that at one point or another. I suppose that's what they refer to as a dream. It's interesting to see how you think about the future. Your eyes may be your mother's, but on the inside, you're just like your father. That might be the worst thing anyone's ever said to me. <laughs> oh, this one's fees. You said mom was unforgettable. Can you tell me more about her? I remember Sayoko like I saw her yesterday. But my memories of her I guess I'd like to keep those for myself. What? Why? I've never met a smarter person. She was a brilliant scientist. It's because of her that I am who I am today. So maybe it's selfishness that makes me want to keep them for myself. And it's probably a very strange thing to say to her daughter. No, I, I get it. I guess. I'm no good at explaining why I like certain guitarists and stuff, so I get it. You said you and I are alike. How is that? I lost my mother when I was three, too. Really? Yes. Do you wish you could remember her? That's never been a desire. What? Does one need memories of their mother for a happy life? Well, my memories of my mom are precious to me. And without her, I wouldn't be who I am. I want to know everything about my mom. I want to remember her. I strongly empathize with how important Sayoko was to you. Yes, we really are a lot alike. How else are we alike? We should discuss that some other time. Thanks for telling me about my mom. I'm glad I got the chance to speak with you. Same here. By the way, what is that? Oh, this? It's my mom's pendant. I see. 
It's very beautiful. Ashley! Dan! I wonder what he wants. Maybe he found a lead about my bag. Um... Ryan, I... It's all right. Go ahead. Okay. Er ist sehr komisch. Und da ich esse gerade was nebenbei. <lacht> What's up, Dan? Sorry to interrupt your camping fun. But I want to ask. Here. Take a look at this photo. Is this who stole your bag? Yeah, that's him. So my hunch was right. There's the missing person's report on him. Wow, really? Let me know if you see him again, okay? Yeah, all right. Were you able to meet up with your dad? Yeah. Glad to hear it. Having fun camping with him? Well, something urgent came up at his lab and he had to go. Lab? Hang on. Is your dad involved with JC Valley? Yeah. Gibt's noch mehr Labs? Oh, of course. You told me your last name is Robbins. So your dad must be Dr. Robbins. Super gemacht, Sherlock. Vermisste Anzeige. Hang on. That kid was reported missing? Yeah, he ran away from home. Been missing for three days. This isn't the first time he's done it either. Last time was this past August. They found him near here. Oh, wow. He's run away more than once. Well, the kid's got his reasons. And he always comes to Lake Juliet. What reasons? His name's Matthew Crusoe. He's 13. Let me know if you see him. Sure. You bet. Why did you say my dad must be Dr. Robbins? Do you know him? It was, oh, maybe two months back? He was fishing, and I taught him how to properly bait his hook. I cannot imagine Dad fishing. Well, something tells me he hasn't been at it for too long. Ah, das wollte doch auf der Insel lernen und hat dann funktioniert, weil er halt gar nichts gefangen hat. You don't say. Still, your dad's really funny. Funny? My dad? <laughs> He's like a kid. His eyes sparkle when he tries something new. He gets absorbed in it, like it's the only thing in the world. He's been especially interested in Lake Juliet lately. Every time I run into him, he has more questions about it. Well, back to patrolling for me. Okay. We'll find your bag. Wait for your dad to get back, and have fun. Thanks, Dan. Nee, wir wollen, wir wollen Sorry, Rucksack. Ryan. Oh. That's the forest ranger who's. <lacht> der ist so mysteriös aufgetaucht, wie er wieder verschwunden ist. Kommt Ryan? einfach, kommt einfach hinter irgendeinem verdammten Baum vor und er hält sich mit dir, haut wieder ab. Where'd he? Hm. Geister Ryan. Uh oh. Huh? What's up, Ian? Dr. Robbins forgot his hat. So he did. Aw, oh, looks like they're cleaning up. Ashley, you got a second? What's up? Did it's only gegessen, oder? Your dad forgot his hat. Would you mind taking it to his cottage? This is dad's? I do not get his taste in fashion. At all. <laughs> 
He bought it online just for this camping trip. We'll take care of the cleanup here, so will you take this to him? You bet. Which way is Dad's cottage? It's just past the covered bridge. Got it. Um, what covered bridge? Be specific, Ian. She doesn't know her way around here. Right, right. Turn right onto the road that leads to the lake shore. You won't be able to miss the bridge. The cottages are just past it. His is the one closest to the bridge. Got it? Um, yep, probably. Oh, and along the way, you'll pass an old boathouse. Stay away from it, all right? Booth. Why? There's a shady guy in sunglasses hanging out around there. So take the long way around if you need to, and keep an eye out for him. All right, got it. Thanks for taking care of the hat. Papa suit. Ja, er sieht aus, wie wenn er sowas tragen würde. Gibt's hier eigentlich? Nein, nicht das. Können wir wieder nachschauen, wo wir die Erinnerung finden? Ah ja, okay. Oh, das ist ein Forschungslabor dann. Wirkt fast ein bisschen enttäuschend, dass wir so eine große Map haben. Also sie wirkt groß. Aber echt wenig auf der Map scheinbar passiert. Oder es sind einfach bloß weniger Origami-Dinger versteckt worden, weil halt das meiste erzählt wird. Oh, it's Tommy. He's with that girl from the campsite. I'll help. Where were you when you realized it was missing? I don't even remember. Don't worry. We'll find it. But... Man besser ein bisschen sorgen. Was? Wow, bei den anderen nicht. Ich darf nicht hingehen und jetzt hat. Tommy? What's wrong? Oh, it's you. Uh, <sighs> You're Elizabeth, right? I'm Ashley. I saw you earlier, but I couldn't really say hi. <laughs> uh. Elizabeth Alfred. Zickig. And ignored. I heard you're looking for something. What is it? Elizabeth lost her music player. We're out here looking for it. There's a demo on that player that we can't lose. Is Elizabeth in your band? Oh, we're in... Tommy, why does this kid know about the band? I heard about it at the guest house. I asked Tommy. <sighs> I told her I'm in a band and I write songs. Are you serious? Yeah. I'm thirsty. I need a drink. We gotta find the music player first. Was zur Hölle? I'll look after I get a drink. Oh, scheiße. Have you even started looking? Come on, I'll help. Why? We're never gonna find it. Ugh. I've had enough of this. You can't just give up. It's somewhere out here. Plus, it's important, isn't it? It's your band's demo. Excuse me? <laughs> Ooh. Who do you think you are, telling me what I should do? What? No, I I'm sorry if... I don't want to hear it. Elizabeth, she's just trying to help. Oh, so you're taking her side? What a jerk. What? No, no, that's not it. You're freaking out over nothing. Come on, stop fighting. Who are you anyway? Why are you even here? Ashley's dad is Dr. Robbins. He works at JC Valley. Well, my dad's the director of JC Valley. Which means my dad is your dad's boss. What's that have to do with us? <laughs> I just thought it was something you should know. I don't see why I should care. So you're going to be like that, huh? How old are you, anyway? I'm 16. There's no way you're the same age as me. What? Why? 
I figured you were like 14. Yeah, I don't believe you. I have trouble believing we're the same age too. Could you just leave already? You're so annoying. I'll leave, but why do you have to be like this? Like what? Seriously? <laughs> Enough already. <laughs> Ugh. I'm sorry, Ashley. You're busy, right? I've got this covered. Tommy. Hmm. All right. I got it. See you later, I guess. See you later. War der sie so alt wie, wie die Ashley? Ich hätte sie mindestens auf 18 geschätzt. Look, I know you're frustrated, but that was not cool. Sorry. Let's just look for it later. Now I need to cool down. Let's go to Bob's. Yeah, okay. That sounds good. Ugh. Oh, ich werde wütend, wenn ich nur drüber nachdenke, was da eben passiert ist. Vor lauter Wut du hast, ich muss was How trinken. Nach Hause gehen und was trinken. Warum nicht einfach das saufen? Ja. Yeah. Ah, na, es geht doch nichts über Cool Pop. Ähm. Kann ich die Mütze eigentlich aufhocken? Wie kann ich hier nicht benutzen? Das ist eine scheiß Mütze, die setzt mal auf. Ich meine, was erwartest du von der Mütze? Ich kann die ja nicht benutzen. Ich muss mich erst vom Spiegel stellen und genau darauf achten, dass sie perfekt hält. Ähm. Wow, it's beautiful. So this is Lake Juliet, huh? Nee, das ist nur der Baumarkt. Mom. Mommy! I remember. Mom brought me here. <laughs> 